We're on day 48 of the Cracky versus uh, DWC, a uh, little grow challenge here. Just so you know, this is my first time doing the uh, Cracky, growing in that. I'm more of a DWC, recirculating uh, deep water culture guy. So you can see peppers here. They're losing a lot of leaves. I started out this unit with a uh, 0.4 EC. So you can see the roots on this, they look good. We started out with a 0.4 EC, started losing a lot of leaves looking bad. I thought it was a nutrition, nutrition deficiency. <clears throat> I raised up the EC from a 0.4. I cranked it all the way up to 1.5 EC, which is the amount of nutrients that's in your water. And within two days, it instantly got massively worse. So I, uh, did something which you think would be like totally, totally wrong. I lowered the EC all the way down to 0.4 EC, which is basically what you would use for something like a real tiny little plant. Just wanting to see, I'm trying to figure it out. I don't know, I don't know Cracky at all. So I'm still trying to figure it out. If you have advice, please give it. So this has no aeration in the uh, bucket. This one has aeration in it. This one has four air stones. I'll pull them up both here a sec together so you can see both of them. There's an absolute massive difference. So here's the roots in the DWC. not even comparable really. So I'm guessing uh, we're having a lot of problems trying to absorb all the nutrients in the cracky version. We do have some, uh, very hard to see here, we do have some small peppers coming in on this one. So that could be uh, also taking some of the nutrients away from the plant which is uh, making it look worse. The DWC does not have peppers yet. It has a million blooms on it. it. Actually, does have one little pepper over here. But I haven't really been pollinating these besides one time since I put these in. I just installed a AC Infinity fan up here to help circulate the air to get some air movement in here. Hopefully, that helps with the pollination of the peppers. Here's the app I'm using to measure the light intensity. I've been using this for a few years, so I understand the difference between uh, the different systems, the different lights. So it might not be perfect, but I know if it's at 500, I know exactly what 500 is going to do to the plants. If it's at 1,000, I understand 1,000. So uh, right now we're at 22. So the light intensity that we're getting underneath these plants right here. We're sitting at uh, 512, 600 in the middle. Actually, this one's showing a little bit less over here, about 460. So this is how I'm measuring my uh, light intensity. I just try to keep it under about 600. If I was uh, supplementing this uh, grow tent with uh, CO2, you could probably crank it up about as high as you want, 1,000 plus, but there's no uh, point in doing that with pepper plants. So this one is way healthier. We are losing a lot of leaves on the cracky version. I should get in here and clean this up a little bit, but I've been trying to let the leaves just all settle on top so I can uh, get an idea of how many I'm actually losing. Uh, there's no signs of pests at all in my tent, so I can't blame it on that. Uh, since I lowered the EC level, it seems like the top leaves are okay, because you'll never improve these bottom leaves. They have a de deficiency. Uh, they're in the process of dying, no matter what I do to this plant. I'll never improve the 
health of these leaves at the bottom. So if you have problems with your plant and you're not looking healthy, you gotta look at the new leaves, you can't look at the old leaves. But the, the size of difference, even the stock on these, the, the DWC one definitely has some uh, thicker, everything's just bigger on, on it, bigger and healthier. I have this one adjusted right here, it's about half level. I did empty it one time in 48 days and uh, just trying to lower the EC, trying to get the health of the plants back. Now the DWC, I've added nutrients one time to it, just trying to keep it up, the water level up high. I can raise it up pretty high and not have an issue just because I have so much uh, air stone and aeration inside the system. Then up top here, we are running the Spider Farmer SF4000 light. It's adjusted way down. I'm not even sure where it's at. It might be like 30%. We're not pushing the plants too crazy. Well, if you have any uh, recommendations on how I fix this plant before I end up killing it, please help. Please leave a comment down at the bottom and uh, share my uh, crazy grow experience with your uh, friends, family, and other crazy people like myself. Thank you.